I've been thinking Paul Pierce hasn't been feeling well. Is he sick? What has been going on? He's been showing a lot of love to LeBron James lately. First, you know, he said what he said, saying he was still the best player in the league. Saying some other things, said he would rather take, if he get one game, he's going to take LeBron because LeBron gave him nightmares and LeBron did what he did to his Boston Celtics. And I'm just like, whoa, is Paul Pierce, is he being serious? But I agree. He said this team will beat the dream team. Now, look, if you look at the early games, it was tough to see. But Kevin Durant clearly makes a difference here on this team. And you just see it. It's more natural. They got lights out shooters. They definitely have more shooters than the dream team. When you break down the roster top to bottom, yeah, the dream team has some bigs. But we got Anthony Davis. We have Bam. So we got some bigs on this team, too. You know, we got Joel Embiid who's arguably the best center in the league. So it's not going to be no slouch. You know what I'm saying? This team, they're going to be playing from the outside. You know, obviously you got to factor in rules, this, this, that, and the third. But I really like this team. When he really broke it down, who's going to guard them, he said, okay, MJ's going to guard LeBron. Then you got Kevin Durant. Then you got Devin Booker. You got Anthony Edwards. And like he said, MJ can't guard everybody. So I'm in agreement with what he said. Uh, First, I really wasn't. I feel like that 08 Redeem team was was the best of all time. But when you really look at it, the Dream Team, excuse me, you know, times was different. Overseas play is getting better year after year. The top players in the league is from there. You got Jokic, you got Giannis, and B will now be the American or whatever, but you get the point. So. Man, Paul Pierce might really be on to something, man. What y'all got? What y'all think? Uh, when you really break it down, you listen to his takes objectively, he makes some great points. But I want to know what you think. Do you agree with Paul Pierce or is he tripping?